Hi, Dave Jack here, Superintendent of Hawking County Schools with another edition of Three Great Things. So I'm not doing my updates anymore. I'm transitioning now back to Three Great Things, which we started doing last week. But uh, rest assured that we're still here to answer your questions. Um, you can send those questions to me or to any one of my staff members directly, and we, we do a pretty good job of reaching back and answering as quickly as we can. But don't be don't be put off if if we refer or if I refer you back to your to your uh, your home school because uh, many of the questions we're getting now are really more school oriented, school focused, and so those questions ought to go uh, directly to your child's school. But um, having said all that, excited about doing coming back to three great things, and um, it's something I always look forward to, and it's typically very easy to find three great things. There's always great things happening in the school division. But let's let's start with um, the, my last podcast. So I, we did a podcast last week with several teachers from the school division, and we talked about virtual instruction and what it looks like and what their fears were and what the opportunities are. And I can just tell you uh, without question, it's my favorite podcast I've ever done. It was so uplifting to me personally, and I, and I, I suspect if you listen to it, if parents listen to it, they, they would feel the same way. Those teachers were so enthusiastic, so prepared uh, for virtual instruction and ready. They were nervous, and they, they talked a lot about the work that's involved in preparing for both synchronous and asynchronous instruction. It's a lot of work. But their enthusiasm, their confidence, their transparency was greatly appreciated. And um, I would encourage you, if you haven't had a chance to look at that podcast, you go to uh, www.fcps. Uh, one.org and you can go to the superintendent's page and you can see a list of my podcasts and you can uh, certainly watch it. it's very good and really appreciated those teachers involvement uh next i wanted to do a quick shout out to the boys and girls club of Fauquier county uh lynn richmond bell who's always been a great partner of Fauquier county public schools has gone above and beyond her she and her staff have gone above and beyond in terms of providing resources for students uh, who may need support in terms of devices or internet access um, and just a, a, a place to go and uh, in with masks and with appropriate distancing and uh, see friends and um, and and complete schoolwork it it um, very appreciative we just thank you I, I saw a post where she had pictures of our of our kids and they're doing various things with their computers or uh, shooting basketball or whatever. I just really appreciate uh, that partnership. And um, a thanks to all the folks at uh, at uh, Boys and Girls Club and especially Lynn, Rich Lynn Richmond Bell. The third great thing I, I, I saw and I want to share with you is I saw a really interesting video from one of our uh, outstanding French teachers, uh, Miss Gepper at Faulkner High School. And uh, Miss Gepper is, is one of my favorites just because of, she has this incredible incredible spirit and enthusiasm and um, she posted a, a, a lesson that she was uh, preparing for students or delivering to students where she was doing some uh, some dancing and it got my attention because i think the 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 enthusiasm and um uh, ingenuity was is a 10 and i think the um the uh, dance moves themselves were original and very good. I'm going to give that a 10 also. Um, but the execution of the dance moves themselves, I, I got to give her a six. I, and I love her, and, and uh, but I, I'm going to have to give her a six because I think there's some work that needs to be done on some of those dance moves. So I'm going to put that out, up as a challenge for Miss Gepper at Bakker High School, who's just an absolutely delightful person, and she takes – uh, and I'm uh, obviously I'm tongue in cheek in this, but um, she's just a great teacher, and kids love her, and she does a great job. So those are my three great things, and I'll be back next week with more three great things. And so in the meantime, have a great rest of the week and a great weekend.